Greetings, dear listeners. Hope you're all doing well. I have attained the uh, 500 level in terms of uh, YouTube subscribers. So I thought I would take a minute to thank some of the people who have helped me with my channel over the past couple of years. To begin with, I'd like to start with Mort from the Mortis Media Channel. I know many of you are regular Mort listeners, and because of that, you know how Mort will often highlight new content creators and new channels and will work collaboratively with newcomers to YouTube. Well, Mort has allowed me to collaborate with him on two separate occasions. And more than that, he has shared my videos at least four times. And I know when Mort shares my videos because normally I get 50 to 75 views per video, 75 if I'm lucky. And when Mort shares them, I get over a thousand views. Not only that, I get great applause like, like you hear right now. As well, Mort has helped me out by answering a lot of technical questions about YouTube and giving me a lot of sage advice for my channel. So he has been a real friend, my number one supporter and my mentor. So thank you, Mort. Next, I'd like to thank John Nair and Kevin Kyle, who work in the digital media studio of the Regina Public Library. Uh, as a storyteller, I was interested in using the YouTube platform as a vehicle for storytelling, but I didn't know how to use the equipment or how I would go about setting up a YouTube channel. So when the digital media studio opened in 2018, I went in, I met Kevin, I met John, I spoke to them and I told them what I was interested in doing. And I said, um, very shyly, uh, you fellas couldn't show me how to use some of this equipment, uh, could you? Well, not only did they say yes, they enthusiastically, I have trouble saying that word, enthusiastically got behind my channel and my project. And over the past couple of years, they've taught me how to use all kinds of recording equipment, showed me how to use programs like Audible, Reason, and Premiere Pro, and they have patiently and cheerfully answered the same dumb questions over and over and over again. So thank you, John, and thank you, Kevin, and I mean that sincerely. Everything I've done is because of you guys. You could have brushed me off. You didn't. And that's why I have my channel today in over 500 subscribers. Next, I'd like to thank my friend Kenton DeYoung. Uh, Kenton is a travel blogger and photographer here in Regina. And I used some of Kenton's wonderful pictures for my video, Germantown, the other Regina. But Kenton is also a local historian. And he, has, he spearheaded a project to raise a monument in the old Regina Cemetery to commemorate the victims of the Spanish flu pandemic of a hundred years ago. And if you watch my video, The Night Floaters of Potter's Field, you will see that monument. I'm gonna leave a link in the description to Kenton's travel blog, and you will wanna check it out because the dude uh, visits some very, very strange places. And uh, Kenton, uh, I will be coming and asking you for permission to use more uh, more of your pictures. As well, I'm gonna leave a link to the Mortis Media Channel on the odd chance that there's somebody out there who has never experienced Mort's wonderful narration. Click on, click on the link in the description, go to it, subscribe to Mortis Media, you won't be sorry. Now, one of my heroes is a gentleman named John Robert Colombo, who's a very famous Canadian poet but he is also the author and editor of over 200 books, many of which are um, feature true Canadian ghost stories or true accounts of uh, Canadian paranormal phenomena. And I got in touch with Mr. Colombo uh, to get some permissions to use some copyright free material that appear in his book, Wendigo, an anthology of fact and fiction. And you can see the results, you can watch the results if you visit my play playlist, Real Canadian Wendigo Stories. Be sure to check that out. I plan to use some more material from some of 
Mr. Columbo's other books, such as Columbo's Book of Marvels in the future. So stay tuned to my channel. Now, most importantly, thank you, dear listeners. You are the most important people of all. Thank you so much for listening to my stories, for taking time to comment, for sharing them, for dropping likes, and hey, even dropping dislikes. When I first started, I got no feedback at all. So I really appreciate the fact that you people will take time to watch my stuff and comment on it. And I promise you that going forward, I will do my best to produce quality material on my channel for your enjoyment. And so, in conclusion, I thank you from my bottom. Uh, that, that didn't quite come out the way I wanted it to, but you, you know what I mean. Anyway, I'm going to get off camera before I say anything else that's dumb. But I'm going to ask the lovely and talented camera crew to give us a panorama shot of our beautiful surroundings. We had the mother of all rainstorms today, but now the clouds are gone and the sun is out. And as you can tell, the voice is choiping. Till midnight. Cheers.